Uh oh, this is not good. Not good. The bear, the bear, and the maiden fair. Dude, I almost one shot at that, man. Holy shit. Here he comes. Here comes the white mask with his cheese claws. But mine are better! Whoa. He is uh, very tanky, dude. Ah, I hate the cheese claws. I hate them. Hey, my dudes. So, I made a bear build in honor of my dog, Bear. It's nothing like him, but still in honor of Bear, nonetheless. Now, I thought this was going to be kind of a ha-ha, funny, stupid build that wasn't going to be good, but it actually kind of surprised me. It's actually pretty goddamn good. I'm going to show you the build real quick, then we'll take it into invasions. So, primarily what we're using here is the red bear claws. Now, these are kind of like the beast claws, except objectively worse in a lot of ways uh reason one is that they are not infusible with the beast claws you can't infuse them which means you know you can do a cult infusion or whatever else to increase the bleed build up on those but on these you cannot do that also if you want to do a full thematic build uh using the red bear's claw is kind of a drawback as well because you need faith for the bear head spell and you need strength for this so you're gonna have split stats no matter what you try to do you could use just the bear claws right and that would be fine you could dump everything into strength but that's no fun you know you want to have the thematic bear build so i've got my stats split because this weapon is not infusible and it scales with strength um the good things about this weapon is that it has an incredible l2 shockingly good actually now, none of that combos, to my knowledge, and uh, it doesn't have a lot of forward momentum. But, it has a lingering hitbox, it does a shitload of damage, and also it gets ridiculous hyper armor, like to the point where it shouldn't have that much hyper armor, I would say. Now, you can kind of, sort of, pseudo combo these, like if you get panic rollers, they will probably get caught by these. So it's really nice, and the last hit is the one that does the most damage, that's the one that really impressed me, was the last hit. I've destroyed hosts with this Ash of War in this game. It's ridiculously good in some circumstances, okay. Now, the actual moveset of these is, uh, it's odd. You have to be really careful with it, because a lot of the time, if you use those running attacks, you will fly past your opponent instead of hitting them. The R2 is better, because it's wider swings, right? But, overall, the spacing on these is really, really easy, because you fly so far forward. You know, there's so much forward momentum on these, it's... Spacing is pretty goddamn easy. The damage on the regular attacks is just okay. It's nothing spectacular. But the spacing potential kind of makes up for it, I think. Now, as far as other aspects of these weapons go, um, they don't do a lot of poise damage. I mean, it's not terrible. I think it's kind of similar to backhand blades, although I don't know the actual poise damage numbers on these. I just know that if an opponent is using heavy armor, uh, these are not going to stagger them on the first hit, basically. But yeah, that's all it is for the red bear claws. They're pretty goddamn cool. I actually kind of like them a lot. And here we got this to cast our bear head incantation because, you know, the bear claws require strength and then the spell requires faith. So this is the best kind of seal we could use. And here we got a parry. Here we got some fashion. I think this is some pretty goddamn cool fashion, honestly. Here we got this to boost the ash of war. We got poise for big strong boys. We got this to boost the bear roar spell. And then we've got this because I figured we'd be getting a lot of consecutive hits. And I figured it would boost these bear claws. And it does, but it's not working as often as I would say I want it to. So if I were you, I would switch out this talisman. You could if you want to. You know, it might be better to use something else like Flock's canvas talisman or whatever. And here is the build. Like I said, the stats are split. We've got all of our bestial incantations because I felt like they fit the theme. And then we've got the star of the show, which is the bear head incantation. Now, having your stats split like this is not optimal at all, but it's what you have to do to get decent damage on the bear and on the weapons. Now, the bear hat does increase this incantation quite a bit. Let's show you the incantation real quick. Uh, this thing is ridiculously good sometimes. It doesn't have any hyper armor, and it's pretty slow. But if a player is within, like, 15 feet of your character when you do it, they're going to get borderline one-shotted. And it's really hard to roll out of it once it starts because it's just a giant. It's like Grail's Roar, but it continues and continues. It's, it's strange, okay, but I, I kind of like this thing too. And you can charge it. 
yeah, that, that shit's pretty good, honestly. I, I like that thing a lot, too. It's really great for using through walls, and if there's players above you, you know, or if you're just getting swarmed, you know, you can do that bear attack, and sometimes it does, like, 15, 1600 damage if all of it lands. It's crazy. But yeah, that's the build. I hope you like it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you're cool and dislike if you dislike it. Or just don't fucking do anything. I don't give a shit. Enjoy the YouTube video. Hey there, Bubba. How we doing? Not too good, huh? Doesn't look very fun for you. And that makes me happy. Oh, he's redonning. Gotta be very careful out here. I thought I got a backstab, it did not happen. Sometimes there's so much anime going on, you can't really see, you know. That's not a very good crossbow, dude. It's not a very good one. I could think of like three better crossbows for you to use, just so you know. Almost got him there. His L2 is very strong, but mine is better. You just fucking wait. I'll prove it to you, bud. Fire in the fucking hole. Yeah, you don't want to be within, like, 15 feet of the fucking bear, dude. It's not good. Dude, these strong wizards coming in clutch right now. I need to move. I'm not sure if these guys can hit me. I don't remember. I don't think they can. If they could, it would be a massive hazard to invaders, and I could see from software laughing about that. Get that evil laugh they do when they mess up invaders. Bruh. Okay, they're they're literally saving my life out here. Get him, get him! That guy's just spamming sword dance. Typical PvE, your behavior. I think this is a moment. Fire and all! Dude, no fucking way. That shit is so good. Like, you guys don't even know. He got fucking evaporated just like that. I need to try the bear incantation more. Should I just run in there and fucking go stupid? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Very nice. Go crazy. Go stupid. Go crazy. Go stupid. Get the veterans. Get them. Oh, yeah. Get them. Fucking bitch ass bitch. Oh, my God. It wouldn't let me repost him. Oh, fuck. Can you not repost with these? I'm actually not sure. Get the fuck out of here, bud. L2 that. Are you done, bro? You done yet? Uh-oh. This is not good. Not good. The bear, the bear, and the maiden fair. Dude, I almost one-shotted that, man. Holy shit. Here he comes. Here comes the white mask with his cheese claws. But mine are better. Whoa. He is, uh, very tanky, dude. Ah, I hate the cheese claws. I hate them. Those things were a fucking mistake. You getting fog walled? Looks like it, yeah. Very Elden Ring of you, bud. He has too much poise, I can't stagger it. Oh! I hate you people. Yeah, come in here, bro. Don't be scared. Don't be afeard. <laughs> bro. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I love it. Dude, what? What the fuck? How is he doing so much damage? That's ridiculous, bro. I cannot stagger this man. Get the fuck out of here, you hideous bitch. Never play this game again. That is a disgusting fucking build, and you deserve to be made fun of. I ain't sorry. Hello there, buddy. Hey, this is a bear moment. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, 1500 damage. That's some good shit, bro. I love it. So the R2 roll catches itself. Oh, fuck. 
I almost got stuck, bro. That was close. Scary. So that is not something I want to trade with at all. Even if this has good hyper armor, I don't want to trade with that shit. Jesus! This thing is fucking disgusting! Disgustingly strong. Wow. Really, bro? Really? How fucking brain dead are you? Explain that to me. I'm gonna fucking hurt you. What? He just does it again? You can't be serious, dog. I don't give a fuck. I'm angry. How you like that, motherfucker? I'll fucking ruin your whole day. You're not gonna like it. I have to be careful with that L2, because even if it's used by an idiot, it can still hurt. That's the thing about Elden Ring. Bad players can get you just by mashing buttons, you know? You just gotta be careful out here. And it's mostly because of hyper armor. Hyper armor starts way too early, and it is way too strong. So people can just mash L2 out of hit stun and get you. Like, look at this. Look, that's all they do. It's like they're programmed to be this way. It makes me so sad. Oh, you got so lucky, dude. The lag done saved your life. I'll oh, take that, Radonathan. You've always been a piece of shit. You've always deserved this, Radon. I'm gonna see if I can... Yes! Yes! Oh, yeah. That's good stuff right there. Nothing more satisfying than a good bear. Really, bro? Just get the fuck out of here, dude. You need to play a different game. Like, this is not working out. You understand? God damn. Godfrey does work with bear incantation. Okay. Oh my god! Fuck! I can't see. It's dark. Too dark. Uh. Fuck you, buddy! Oh, I hit him. Wow. That's that's not bad range at all. I'm going fucking crazy, bro. I'm about to go stupid, bro. You think your L2 is fucking funny, bro? You think it's fucking funny, bro? Oh shit, there's a big man there. I can't see you guys, it's too dark. Ow! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Dude, that R2, holy shit! What? Dude, no fucking way. Four hundred damage when I hit both. Oh, you're fucked, buddy. You're in danger. <laughs> oh yes, yes. Ah! <laughs> oh, it's a Moonvale wizard. How original! Never seen this build before. Get the fuck out of here, you stupid motherfucker. That's the first thing you got to say. Where's your summon at? I want to beat his ass, too. Where is this dude? It says he has a summon. Ooh, his net's bad. Oh, this is not good. Let's get the fuck out of here. 